so popping up energy to see if the spell is working so you've got someone that's going to be popping up in your energy to see if their spell work is working this could be mentally physically emotionally this person is the type of person that likes them to be poor and insecure they like you to be in that poor and insecure energy so if a person's approached you male or female doesn't matter what this is if a person's approached you their first thought of you was that you was poor and insecure over a period of time they've got to realize that you're not that and they need you to be poor and insecure but you have evaded the poor and insecure trap so when you feel poor and insecure, you put out this energy that you can't see, but a lot of energy vampires can see it. A lot of terrible sort of people. So these are the type of people that take the nothing, they will make you believe that you are nothing, can you have nothing? But the nothing that you have, they will take it from you, claiming that they're building in your best interests. A lot of hours, our plans with your money, with your resources, with your time, with your energy. So they will take from you the little that you have and tell you that it's to build you up when it's not. It's just to build them. Now there's this thing called baby fat jeans here, right? That once you realise that, that people use baby fat to do spell work. So like, first of all, how did they get the fat out of the baby? And then you're like, baby fat jeans. The stuff you're like, they might, they might just shut me down with this one. They're like, don't you? They can, they can run and jump off the nearest curb. <laughs> That's how low they are. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> so some people are only close to you to see if the spell work is working. So you might have people that's been your long time coldies, your life don't go too good, you go and tell these people. I beg, always look for the sly smirk. When you're telling people your problems, you're so into your problem, yeah, that you're not even watching the person's reaction. We watch their reactions to what you have to say, I beg, I beg in the name of the almighty creator, start watching people and their reactions. Start watching them, because when you tell them that you, you've got problems, and they start smiling slyly that means they're the root cause of your problem and that you must walk far from these people so i'm going to do a whole reading on this because these are the type of things that you can take on a small level and on a big level and on an even grander scale do you get it like so some people are only close to you to see if their spell work is working thank you chair some people only come forward when you look like you're in distress and the moment that you look good and turn up here right they they back away from you because that's not the energy that they was wanting don't feel low because you get you didn't get picked don't feel low because they didn't pick you don't feel low because people chat to you for a time and then disappear they ghost you don't worry about the ghosting worry about the love bombing stage worry about the gaslighting stage don't worry about the ghosting because if they're ghosting ghost them Go stand back. If you don't scale in their life, then don't make them have no scale in your life. If you continuously keep thinking about somebody that you already know likes people poor and insecure, they're popping up in your energy to see if their spell work is working. Don't contact people. Let them contact you and you make yourself clearly visible. So if they don't want to contact you, in the forms of a text message even if they have your address they can write you one letter put one stamp on it and write but no one people don't want to do that people don't want to use their energy but they want to use yours beware vultures rule c777 saying this is a healing oracle message light work for man ah eh smiddle <laughs> get me no watch no face Build up your skills, mentally and emotionally. There you go.